a lot of times we are faced with challenges where we want to give the customers the best and I think the thing that concerns us most is that we do it in the time that we're saying we're going to do it. We shot for spring and here we are at spring and we're right on time. You think about it when we first introduced the internet in 2000, when we first introduced broadband I should say in 2000, we had, most people had a computer connected directly to their cable modem. So that paradigm has shifted completely to now we have wireless routers, which means that everybody can, can connect without having a network set up throughout the home, which is very important. A recent study has uh, shown that uh, consumers' bandwidth needs increase um, by 50% every year. Uh, we've built a network to be able to support that. So we anticipate within the next 12 months that whatever you're using now, you'd be using 50% more and we, we're ready for it. I have friends who have two-year-old kids that are now using the internet. So the stage in which people are using the internet, when they get introduced to it, is becoming earlier and earlier. Therefore, that is spreading out throughout the entire multifamily of users. Not only do I have an IP-based phone, but there are three different laptops in the house. And at any point, all three of us are on the computer at the same time. And yes, we are all using a lot of bandwidth. Yes, you would have your router in place. Yes, you can be on the phone. Yes, you can be downloading video. Yes, you can be Skyping. Yes, you can be listening to a playlist. And you would not see the difference one bit. Um, I have a nine-year-old and a five-year-old. And um, whenever I get home with my iPad and my iPhone, they grab it and they run with it. And they basically have it until I'm ready, to, until they, I tucked them away in bed. But that same thing, I think, applies across the board to all families. Uh, when you talk about educational-wise, business-wise, this particular service will provide that avenue, or uh, that continued avenue, but now with a faster and a more um, powerful means. So I think the power, not think, but I'm 100% certain that it just opens up so many doors now for um, our customers. In my home, I come home and my son, he's on the iPad, as well as he's on his uh, DS3 while he's playing a game with his friend who is somewhere else around the world. And they're playing on that device. I have my laptop and I have my iPad on the side where I'm doing something else. Everyone is doing more than one thing typically in the household. Uh, my wife would be on her computer, which is, again, all using that same network. For many years now, the word and the, the talk has been about the information highway. But in terms of if you're not able to be able to get on that highway and to maintain those speeds, you very quickly fall by the wayside. But if you can maintain those speeds and it gives you the, that urge to stay on, because there's just so much information now that is easily at your access. And as I said, whether it's for your business or whether it's for education, uh, it just provides, or even entertainment, in terms of looking for something as simple as a recipe to cook with or whatever. But it provides that level of comfort, knowing that, hey, I'm connected, I'm on, and I have a reliable service, and the speeds are just phenomenal. One of the things that we pride ourselves on is we promised our public, we promised the Bahamians that we would always provide them with the best technology. And it's on that promise alone that when we purchase things to provide for our community, we've given ourselves a little bit of room. So rather than just shooting for A and B, we go all the way to Z. We make sure that it's the high end. We make sure that it's the best. And it's not just the best for today, it's the best for tomorrow and the day after.